The greatest feeling in the world is to lead somebody to Jesus. To come along with a group of people who also help work on the physical aspects, the, the doctors and the nurses and things like that, is a, is a blessing. To see all of it put together in one missionary trip is just, it's remarkable. So that's why I really wanted to be a part of it. I think when you can meet people's physical needs and make them feel better, they'll be more likely to listen to the other things that you have to say and they see that you're there to help them. It's important to take care of people's physical needs, first of all, because when you have listened to them and met a need, they most times will be more responsive to listening to what you have to say about the gospel. A couple years ago, I went to the Philippines and I worked in Manila and I got to work in the hospital, which is their tertiary care hospital. So I just love the experience because I always wanted to do Doctors Without Borders. But I was looking for that same kind of thing, just like making something a little better. It brings people out that, that we would not normally come in contact with and yet they have needs. And when they can, are able to get help with those needs and have nowhere else to turn really to find help for them, then uh, it presents an opportunity. And that opportunity for us is is the most important one, which is to share the gospel with them. I'm looking forward to all the people that are coming to these clinics, eager to have a physical need taken care of, that they will also learn that that is just temporary, but the most important is the spiritual need, because that's forever. I think a lot of these people that we are treating uh, may not come to hear the spiritual side of things unless we were offering this medical care. But I think overwhelming majority of them, once we get them there and we start talking to them about God and how that can change their life, they're very interested in listening. And I think it does truly open the door to that side of things. I think that every single time that I lead someone to Christ, it really reminds me of when I first came to Christ. But whenever I get to come on these trips, um, I get to see so many people be born again. And I, it just reminds me of my rebirth in Christ. And I think that is so cool. <laughs> is that all? That's it. Okay. That was easy, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, did you want to say anything else like, hi, Mom? Hi, Mom. <laughs> I love you. It's my brother's birthday, so if you want to put that in a video, I'll be like, happy birthday, Jeremy. Okay, go ahead. Say. <laughs> happy birthday, Jeremy. <laughs>